at the planet and how peaceful it looks. And immediately the thing that comes to mind is, okay, what are we doing wrong? You know, why is it, why is it not the way that it looks to be? I tell people all the time, it, 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 I'm not sure Americans particularly grasp the significance of what's going to happen. For the first time in more than 40 years, the most powerful nation in the world will be sending a spacecraft intended to carry humans farther than, uh, than we've been in 40 years. We've, we've not designed a spacecraft to do this since the Apollo era. And so when we launch in December, uh, it'll be something that a whole generation of Americans have not seen. We're here this week looking at, I mean, I think we're really looking at our future when we see that capsule out there, you know, floating in the water and figuring out how to recover it and how to get our crews back safely home and stuff. And it really is. It's all about our future. It's about improving life here on Earth, and it's about improving how we explore further and further off our planet, which ultimately, I think, comes back to making life better here on Earth for, for people. What, what NASA's doing putting people in space, flying on space station, building Orion to go eventually to Mars. You know, this is right on the very edge of our human capability. I think one of the things I really enjoy about the Orion program is the teamwork. You've got a lot of dedicated people that are really uh, passionate about what they do. You know, we want to put people out in deep space. We want to continue exploring space, find out what's out there. You know, is there any life on Mars? How are the planets formed? Where do we fit in? Uh, yeah. It's all the, you know, the questions that mankind has been asking for thousands of years. You know, everybody wants to go to the moon now because other than my generation, nobody ever saw that. And, and so it's, it's a novelty to them. This will give them an opportunity to see a vehicle that is intended to go back to the moon, to go on to Mars, and, you know, make Mars closer than 30 years away. My